Alrighty, hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I am working on the helicopter carrier, and what I have here so far is this is the redesign. We're going to be able to fit one helicopter here in the back and one in the front, and then two on the deck, and that's maximum capacity. Uh, let's see, I had to compress the uh, engine here and then we're gonna have one floor like for the pilots and stuff right off the flight deck and then we'll have one floor for communications and stuff and sleeping and that it won't be much right the four helicopters small crew uh, and there's a little bit of room at the front as well but this is probably gonna be ammunition storage and stuff like that maybe where the galley is I'm not sure yet uh, yeah so that's where we're at uh, don't know if I want to redesign this. I'll just spawn it in. It'll lift because the crane. I don't have a counterweight yet for the crane. So the crane is just to pick up, recover helicopters if they crash. Um, it's not very deep. It goes 150 meters, but, you know, it's a crane. For anything deeper, I have we have the, the other, the Navy recovery vessel. So, yeah, something like that. I flared out the flight deck a little bit just so it's a bit wider on the sides. And then in the front here, we're going to have a couple of guns. In the back, we'll have some guns and some radar, anti-air, whatever. Yeah. And then the superstructure obviously won't be so rigid. I'll try and design it a little bit. So that's pretty much that's pretty much that. We'll have four helicopters. So what I'm working on right now is trying to get the the loading system for the helicopters in place. Um. So when you land, oh boy, sorry about that, that's laggy. When you land on the flight deck, we want to be able to, to go down and be stored. And then of course there needs to be a roof on that and then another helicopter can fly down and sit on top of it. That's the idea here, we can fit two down below. So I'm thinking you're gonna land here this will go down and soar and then another helicopter can land on a plate which will come down and then we need to have a roof on here something like that maybe an airlock door that slides back over here and then this is going to be just a storage area for another helicopter and I'll have sliders and that way you'll be able to move the helicopter just be able to slide it here to take off so the main helicopter will be sitting here in the front, whatever that'll be. That could be a, one of these attack helicopters, or it could be a transportation helicopter. Yeah, you could take off from here. It just might be a little risky um, because the helicopter is going to be... You know, you'll be right there. So if you can take off without hitting the crane, might be able to. Yeah. But I think it'll be easier. Just slide forwards, then you're clear. Take off. Done. Right, so that's what I'm working on. Uh, we'll see how it goes, and we'll see how the super, the superstructure turns out. I don't know why I made it so wide like that. I was thinking maybe um, I'd put a long-range radar on it. Whoops. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, 500,000 meters. So something like that. Maybe we'll put that radar on it. And uh seems to be working okay now. <laughs> yeah, so I'm not sure. Uh, but thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.